Hi, this is attorney Rich Gillardi with Shane Smith Law. Today we're going to be talking about when it's required to show the police an identification. Yeah, we're just now taking pictures in public. Do you have a name? I do. Can I have it? No, sir, not right now. Why not? Why would you want my name? You wanted my name. Well, you're a public servant. Okay, and now I'm asking you for your ID. You have to be lawfully arrested to provide you with ID. Is that right? We're going to remain silent at this time. I mean, I'm on public property. I you're, you're exactly right. That's why police out here now. Since these gentlemen are walking on public property, they are not required to provide an ID. And generally the law is that you do not have to carry an ID with you if you're walking around. Certainly if you're operating a motor vehicle, you have to have a form of identification, registration, that sort of thing. But in the video, as you saw, people were just walking around that it's not necessary for those gentlemen to have IDs with them. I don't have my ID. Suspicious activity. I mean, I got a call out here. Now I got ID. Uh, that's not how it goes. If the police ask you for an ID because you're engaging in suspicious or potentially illegal activity, then you have to comply with law enforcement. Again, this situation, they were just filming buildings, so it's nothing illegal. And in that type of scenario, it's not necessary to provide an ID to the police. Here's the thing, not doing anything wrong. However, it is a government installation that you are videotaping. I just want to advise you of that. I don't know what regulations they have, but that, that's on y'all. You, you want to stay out here, videotape them. If you are engaging in suspicious activity that could rise to the level of something that is potentially a crime, such as filming a government building or getting close to a government film, building or with filming and trying to film entrances or something along those lines, which could certainly come across as suspicious, then the police can detain you and ask for an ID. But just filming a building in and of itself is not a legal activity, not criminal conduct, and not you are not required to produce an ID if asked. Well, I'm going to go, go talk these, to these guys over here. Y'all have a happy 4th of July, right? Me too. If you need help with this or anything else, please reach out to us at 980 999 Nine 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 in pain, call Shane. In pain, so I call Shane. Nine eight zero nine 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 nine. In pain, call Shane.